In this video, we're going to be taking a look at installing and testing the adjustable Sinman door barricade bracket system, which is a simple and effective way of reinforcing both in swinging and out swinging doors in your home. So this is the adjustable Sinman door barricade bracket system. This kit comes with two adjustable brackets, 10 wood screws for securing the brackets to a door or wall, and 10 machine screws to fix the width of the brackets. And you'll just need to supply your own 2x4 to secure the door and complete the setup. These brackets are patented and extremely well designed and engineered and made from extra thick 4mm high strength steel and powder coated, which provides a long lasting rust proof finish perfect for indoor or outdoor use. These brackets are much thicker and stronger than a lot of similar brackets on the market and they're also highly adaptable and can be installed on many different types of doors. Installing the door barricade brackets is really easy and can be done in just a few minutes and I'm going to be doing this installation on an out swinging door and attaching the brackets to the door directly. Since my door is hollow core, I pre-drilled some holes and popped in some anchors to hold the screws in place. The wall anchors were not included so you need to purchase some that can withstand high amounts of force. If you have a solid wood door, you don't need any anchors and you can go ahead and drive the screws directly. Once the bottom of the bracket is mounted to the door, you can fasten the top of the bracket with the included machine screws and then slide in a 2x4 and the door is now reinforced. This bracket also works on an in-swinging door with trim. All you need to do is install the bracket on either side of the door trim and adjust the width of the brackets so that there's just enough room for the 2x4 to slide in. The brackets in the 2x4 held up well and neither were damaged in the test. The door is still intact and there wasn't any damage to the frame or the door either. 